one. Look at that. Jesus. Holy crap. my next video i don't know what number it is must be up to 80 odd now uh, today we're using equinox i borrowed off reynolds so let's see what we can find good morning back on the fields of derbyshire after a week on the cornish beaches uh, i must say i'm really excited to be back here i've got some new fields today never set foot in this one uh, I'm confident there's going to be stuff in here. Grass has been chewed down to almost nothing. The only problem is I've still got Reynolds Equinox, so I fully expect to be digging a load of little bits of crap, iron, and God knows what. But you never know. You never know. Let's see what we can find. Well, there's the gate I just climbed over. Did my intro. Took five or six steps. Got a solid twenty. And look at that. Tell you what, the ground is like blancmange. It is so, so soft. We've got a Queen Victoria Vale Head Penny. 18... I can't quite see, 1891 is that? 1890-something. Well, that's a great start. Equinox. I'm going to have to get one of these, aren't I? Lovely conditions as well. It's cool, breezy. Autumn's on the way. My favourite time of the year. Next signal. It's felt a little bit bigger. It's, it was a 20 again. I thought it might have silver on it, but it's not. I think it might be lipstick, something makeup related, I don't know. Yep, let's carry on. Another eggshell challenge. Who would live in an egg like this? Anybody know? It's quite small. I can't remember what the last eggs were that I found, but yeah. This is looking like my next coin with the Equinox. Not sure about that orange cable though, Reynolds. Did you get that from an onion bag or Satsumas or something? Anyway, this is coming in at solid 20. I think we've got a half penny. George the Sixth. Ship half penny. What have we got? 1941. Yep. Let's carry on. Next signal with the Equinox, like almost everything, it comes in a 13, 14, and it's this little thing. Don't actually know what that is. Not sure. If anyone knows, give us a holler. Well, I've almost done a full lap of this uh, field now. I've certainly found the two coins. Uh, this is my next signal. <laughs> Look at this, it's a little hand cannon. That is pretty cool. I wonder how old that is. We've actually fired stuff. I bet I should enjoy that. This doesn't search it. Right, let's carry on. if you can see this dark line along the middle of the field well, that's a footpath check this out got a nice old style there but that's been there a few hundred years as soon as i've completed my lap i'm going to do some uh, i'm going to grid this path out and uh, detect the hell out of it i've got all these next fields as well a lot of land today very nearly back at the gate which had a nice sweet 20 21 kind of signal um it was pretty deep probably eight to ten inch pulled her out and we've got what looks like our first mystery coin of the day it's actually still got some some detail on it it's looking like george the third half penny yep let's carry on i had two signals next to each other so i've got both out they're both 22 they were both probably six or seven inches deep uh, i've seen one 
fall out there. That's a big penny. I'm guessing this is going to be the same. There it is, look. Look at that. It's a lovely George V penny in that one. And that's also a George V penny. Oh, sorry, that's a George VI. Yep, two pennies. Take that. See so if there's any more. Just had the two big pennies from there and there somewhere. I had a 14.15 here. I was convinced that was a silver coin, but no, it's a button missing the shank. It does look and feel very silver though. I don't think it is. Okay, the church. Must be about 11 o'clock, is it? Right, next signal. Look how deep that was, full length of the pointer and it's one of my favourite things to find a medieval pot leg to go to my collection must have probably 9 or 10 of those now don't mind finding them let's crack on next signal, yet another 13, 14 and it's come out on the spade probably going to be a button or just a loop thing Yeah, it's just a button. Yep, let's crack on. Been on those fields in the distance over there. I did not find anything. I think I found like one coin in like four hours. That was where that fishing knot was, if you remember. Uh, next up, this was a 20. Uh, and what have we got? Oh, it's another button. Tricked with the silver gilt. This sounds sweet. Where's it gone? Sweet-ish. 21, 22. Let's have a look. I opened it up and I can see something round, thin and coin-like. Solid 21 that was. Nice signal. Five or six inches deep. Mystery coin. Completely toasted. Next up, solid 19 is in the second scoop and we've got a medieval horse harness loop. It's a few hundred years old, that's for sure. Lovely bit of land. Just been speaking to a, a neighbour and he says it's all been done. But uh, anyway, here's my next find. Crusty mystery coin. Let's crack on. Well, I finally found some silver close to this big tree, although it is pretty much scrap silver. Don't know what it is or was, but it certainly was something. It's got patterns on it. Just on this end piece there. It's all twisted and mangled. I'll have to go in the silver scrap tub at home, I think. Just wondering what that thing is over there. It's like a little trough with a, a gravestone or something. Anyway, this was a solid 21, opened it up and it slipped out. I've completely annihilated it with my spade, but luckily it's just a half penny. The bloke up there says, uh, oh, you won't find anything in there, it's been done. Three or four guys have done it to death. I says, I like a challenge. I think it's going to rain. Uh, next up in the field that I'm not going to find anything in, We've got some sort of buckle type thing. Uh, not very old, I don't think. Solid 22, that was, on the Equinox. Right, let's carry on. Next up in the field, I'm not going to find anything. Solid 22 on the Nox. Quite clearly see there's been a coin there. And it's just down here, look. I think it might be a bit twisted and bent up. But I don't mind that. It's another Georgian coin. Proof there's still stuff in here. Yeah, this kind of landscape is exactly where I like detecting. You know, it's dead uneven, bobbly. There's mounds, little trees, reeds. Got the footpaths. It's perfect for me. This. I don't care if it's been detected or not. Next up, uh, we've got a pewter button. Another trick 
silver. Reynolds finds loads of these. Give a good signal. Look at this. We've got a ring of mushrooms. Oh, like a half ring anyway. I wonder why they grow there. Must be something in the soil. In that little patch. How oh, very odd. Definitely not going to eat one of those. Although I'm getting hungry. I'm working my way back to my bag now, my lunch. The house is stunning. Next signal is right down there. And it was a solid 11. I've got it out. And it's a little pewter button. It's got a little pattern on it. Look, a little flowery pattern. Shanks broke. Yep. Well, it's about quarter past 12. And uh, can't wait anymore. I'll make it lunchtime today. Got the eggs on it. So, guys. Chicken on a stick. Hot and spicy. A little Kit Kat for after. We've got a, a nice beer today, look. Clean crisp lager, generously hot and soft caramel neck. Hills neck, not my usual thing. I'm gonna drink it anyway. Tell you what, really enjoyed that. Cheers guys. Let's get back out there. This is my first signal since lunch. Definitely a coin. Lovely sweet tone that one was. Quite deep as well. Um, and there it is. Couldn't tell you what that is, but it's thick. Could be a William the Third. It could be a token actually. I'll give it a little clean. Signal. This was coming in a solid 20. Six or seven inches deep. I reckon we've got a half penny. That's how it landed. It came out. Elizabeth II, our current queen. Ship half penny. 1958. Yep. Next up, this one was coming in at solid 28. I feel like there's something else in there as well. Or it might just be that, but it's looking like a 2p, unfortunately. Is it the modern 2p? Rubbish. Does anyone know if you can eat these? Is this a damson? I don't think it's a blueberry. It's on a massive tree. Hey, edible. Someone let me know, because I really want to eat one. They look nice. Yum. I love the look of this field. Dead thin, small. I'm going to... Uh, Make my way to the top. This was a solid 20. It's looking like a coin. We've got a Victoria penny. Queen Victoria, nice early one. 1861. Gotta be some, some silver coins on here still. Left by the other guys. Next signal. I will clean this up by the way. By the penny that I just had. Look at the depth on that. That is a pinpointer and a third. Uh, I don't know what it is. It's not lead. It's got to be bronze. Maybe a plate fragment or something. Not sure, but that was mega deep. Something a little bit different. This was a 15. I thought it was going to be a 1p, but it isn't. Let's put it over. It's got. 105 written on it in a hole through the through there funny looking pendant don't know what it is but yeah let's carry on well, i'm almost at the top of this hill another signal and another footpath didn't know that was there this is coming in at solid 17 it's about the size of a 1p, modern, it could be a farthing, that is a farthing, look, 1941, Wren farthing, George the Sixth. Yep, it's another coin. Next signal on the Equinox, this is a bit of a ball like to find, oh, you can quite clearly see where it's been, it's a Battered, beat up, something or other. Not sure what that is. It's like a mount off something. 
Got three holes on it. Yep, let's carry on. Another signal. And I think this one's looking like a musket ball. I can't actually remember what the number was. But yeah, that's exactly what it is. Quite a big one. Cool. Don't mind a musket ball. Working my way back down this hill now. Down the other side. So I'm on this right side. I came up this side. And this looks like a coin. Solid 90. Felt like a coin. Nice and sweet. It's another crusty, crusty copper mystery coin. Yep. Spade still going strong. Noble MDT if you want one. Get in touch with Carl. Right, this is a solid 20. I reckon it's going to be a Victoria. Something or other. But no. We've got a nice smooth George V half penny. Date is too... Two one seat. Let's go on. I'm not gonna lie, I'm enjoying using the Equinox. Wherever it's gone. Where is it? There it is. It's a little bit heavy compared to uh, the RX, but it's finding all the same stuff. Um, and probably getting a few more signals. Mm. Yeah, I like it. it. Gives a good, a good signal for deep stuff, whereas my RX gives a really faint, faint signal. So, yeah. This is my first signal in ages. There's a solid 22. And we've got another mystery coin. Nothing left on that. This is an interesting one. Another 14 on the Knox. I think this is a Jetton. Don't weigh very much. But look at the patterns on it. I don't know if you can see that. Definitely got patterns on it, and there's a shield. I'm sure, there's a shield on this side. I'm gonna go and find my bag and get my spray and give it a clean, and I'll come back to you. Just have a look at that. That is beautiful. I've cleaned it up, and I reckon that's a jetting. So, a sort of a copper hammered from France, maybe, or Germany, I'm not sure. But look at that. That is a really cool find. I've only ever found one jetting before and it was in really bad shape. But this one's awesome. Oh my god, look at that! Jesus! I'm no expert on planes, but that looked like a B-52 bomber or something similar. That jetting was absolutely brilliant. Best find of the day for me so far. Next up, 25. It's got to be a coin that has, hasn't it? Six, seven inches deep. Oh, there we go. What we got? Don't actually know. It's a cool imprint though, look. Right, let's crack on. A lot of aeroplanes flying about today. This was a faint 20, so it's pretty deep, but not that deep. It's looking like a half penny. I've not got it out yet. That's a big penny. It's a Vicky penny. Yeah, it wasn't the greatest signal that. Hit it with my spade, look. Amateur, 1875. Nice, smooth, Vicky Penny. Last me done for today. Uh, the battery on the Knox has died, so that's the end of that. Um, but what a, what a great day I've had. No, no silver coins today, but I've had that jet and that's my, by far my favorite find. Uh, cheers for watching, I'll see you on the next one.
this is what I found today with the Equinox. A lot of coins, a lot of artifacts. Um, I'm not going to go through them all, but Victoria pennies, George fifth and sixth pennies. Actually, I'm going to go through them all. <laughs> We've got the mystery coins, probably Georgian. Elizabeth II and George VI. Uh, that's the best find for me today. Uh, it's a French jet, and I think. Do really like that. Don't know what that was. A 105 something or other. And we got the hand cannon. <laughs> I quite like that. Uh, silver scrap. Don't know what it's from. Medieval pot leg. Load of buttons. Buckle. Uh, lead shot. Yep. I've enjoyed using Equinox today. It's been a blast. See you on the next.